Hello dear subscribers, today we are going to talk about stem cell research. What are stem cells? Stem cells are special human cells that are able to develop into many different cell types. This can range from muscle cells to brain cells. In some cases, they can also fix damaged tissues. The researchers believe that stem cell based therapies may one day be used to treat serious illnesses. Stem cells are divided into two main forms. There are embryonic stem cells and adult stem cells. Stem cells can differentiate into other kinds of cells. Stem cell research has serious ethical issues. Before a cell has differentiated or specialized, it is called a stem cell. Stem cells can replicate many times and they have the potential to become different types of cells like adipocytes, hepatocytes, muscle cells, enterocytes, neurons and other cells. Now, Let's talk about adult stem cells. There are two types of adult stem cells. One type comes from fully developed tissues such as the brain, skin and bone marrow. There are only small numbers of stem cells in these tissues. They are more likely to generate only certain types of cells. For example, a stem cell that comes from the liver will only make more liver cells. The second type is induced pluripotent stem cells. These are adult stem cells that have been changed in a lab to be more like embryonic stem cells. Scientists first reported that human stem cells could be changed in this way in 2006. Induced pluripotent stem cells don't seem to be different from embryonic stem cells, but scientists have not yet found one that can develop every kind of cell and tissue. How to use stem cells in medicine? The only stem cells now used to treat disease are hematopoietic stem cells. These are the blood cell forming adult stem cells found in bone marrow. Every type of blood cell in the bone marrow starts as a stem cell. Stem cells are immature cells that are able to make other blood cells that mature and function as needed. These cells are used in procedures such as bone marrow transplants. These help people with cancer make new blood cells after their own hematopoietic stem cells have been killed by radiation therapy and chemotherapy. They may also be used to treat people with conditions such as Fanconi anemia. This is a blood disorder that causes the body's bone marrow to fail. What about embryonic stem cells? The embryonic stem cells used in research today come from unused embryos. This results from an in vitro fertilization procedure. They are donated to science. These embryonic stem cells are pluripotent. This means that they can turn into more than one type of cells. Stem cells may help your health in the future in many ways and through many new treatments. Researchers think that stem cells will be used to help create new tissues. For example, one day healthcare providers may be able to treat people with chronic heart disease. They can do this by growing healthy heart muscle cells in the lab and transplanting them into damaged hearts. Other treatments could target illness such as type 1 diabetes, spinal cord injuries, Alzheimer's disease, and rheumatoid arthritis. New medicines could also be tested on cells made from pluripotent stem cells. Are embryonic stem cells better to use than adult stem cells? Using embryonic stem cells destroys the embryo. Is it right to exchange one life for another? 
Do the benefit outweigh the costs? Will it lead to designer babies? A life for a life? Please, dear subscribers, write what do you think about stem cell therapy in comments. I will be very happy to see your comments and discussions under this video. Thank you for watching this video until the end. Please subscribe to this channel and thumb up.